Hey, what's up guys? Today I just want to show you real quick how I made this uh, little Uzi word type loop. Um, yeah, you just heard it in the beginning. Um, so I'm just going to keep this really short, uh, really straight to the point. Um, so I don't waste uh, any time. Um, yeah, because my online classes, they continue in a couple of minutes. So as I said, I'm going to keep this, uh, keep this very short. So the first sound that I used was uh, this plug right here so this audio clip um, is basically the same as this pattern uh, I just had to export it because of the CPU um, here's what it sounds like yeah let's uh, look at the pattern real quick so um, over here you can see um, I have a nice top melody right here, you know, with these notes as well. Um, but yeah, this is essentially just the top melody, uh, some chords underneath it, and the bass line. Um, yeah. So the way I got this bass line right here, I just uh, copied the bass, uh, the root notes of the chords, uh, and then I pressed Alt U. Which, which brings up this uh, chopper tool right here and I put it on this setting press uh, accept and then shift D yeah now shift D uh, to make it like really chopped you know so this basically is your common Uzi progression um, it's in the scale of G minor and it goes down and goes back up that's basically everything and then this top melody, you just play around with some notes uh, that sound good. Um, yeah. So after that, uh, I layered this uh, same exact pattern with this sound right here. Yeah, this is a pad, and I removed or I deleted the. the chopped bass notes uh, because I thought it was like too muddy and too much going on so I deleted those and um, yeah but the rest is also like the rest is everything the same um, afterwards I went ahead and grabbed this bell right here just um, to make like a simple accent melody Yeah, this bell is uh, from my one-shot kit. Um, it's the this bell right here. Um, you can get this one-shot kit. It's the uh, first link in the description if you want that exact same sound. Um, oh, let me show you the, the other sounds I used real quick. So over here we got this uh, plug right here. You can see. <laughs> uh, I don't know how to pronounce it, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, and then the other sound, the pad is... Um, this sound right here if it would open yeah it's uh, this pad right here okay um, then I grabbed some strings um, as you can see I don't have the top melody and I also don't have the bass notes so this is like just the chords with a bit of melody because um, yeah I just thought it sounded cool with uh, this part right here um, yeah so I kept that yeah after that um, I found this vocal drop right here really nice vocal drop um, but as you can see it is not like it is not the same BPM and not the same like scale so all you gotta do is um, you press this button right here um, press it get it to four bars and then you drag it out to where it originally was um, make sure the mode is on auto so it do does not uh, change the pitch and then afterwards you just um, like see which um, like pitch you have to um, pitch it to so in this case it was uh, plus uh, one semitone um, so I did that <laughs> yeah really nice vocal chop um, and then to finish it off I got this bass right here
yeah, this just follows the root notes of the chords, um, nothing really special. And then all together it sounds like uh, this. Yeah, really nice. Um, for the for the mixer channels, um, I've just put on some Valhalla vintage verb right here, um, and an EQ. This is like the same preset on every every layer. You can see like um, I messed with the settings a bit, but like the um, the, the the effects are the same. <clears throat> and uh, over here, I also added an imager. This is like for the pad to make it wider um, and right here this is uh, for this uh, accent melody I got the stereo enhancer um, the strings preset to make it like sound like it's more in the back and stuff so that sounds pretty cool yeah that's uh, pretty much it for this tutorial if you like it um, make sure you drop a like subscribe for, for more tutorials you know um, yeah and uh, have a great day